Hey YouTube, it's Alyssa and I just got out of the shower and I'm completely fresh fresh faced um, besides spreading vanity cream and Cetaphil all over my face and neck. Um, as you can see I'm really shiny and I have some red eczema patches around my eyes and I just want to scream because I don't know what it's from. Actually that's a lie, I do know what it's from. It's from having allergy eyes. My doctor prescribed me um, Neomycin and polymyxin drops that I used for about a week. It cleared up my eyes. However, the skin around my eyes, because I was scratching my eyes out, it's become pretty bad. And he also prescribed me Flonase, which, you know, you put you up your nose and stuff, and uh, it's helped clear up my sinuses, but it still hasn't cleared up the skin around. And I wanted to show you the three um, eczema creams that I have. One is hydrocortisone cream that the doctor said I can put on my face if I have bad eczema. And the only bad eczema I have, bad quote quote, is around my eyes right now. And it is not a good idea to put steroids around your eyes, so I don't suggest you. Not that I have. Um, I'm just saying don't do it if you just have maybe some like small patches. I had a small patch around my eyebrow the other day, but um, it's gone and I didn't put any steroids on it, probably just from stress or something. And I have trimethicolone, um, which I put on my neck and the back of my neck, and I also have clobetazole. I had this white, just this crazy patch around my, my arm and I don't know what it's from. This is one of the strongest ones, so I don't suggest lathering this on, and I don't suggest using it all the time. Um, minimal use, minimal use for any steroid creams. Try to stay away from them if you can go a natural route, if you can just de-stress and maybe do some yoga. That's the best suggestion I can give you, but it's hard. And I have my sister's wedding com coming up, so I don't want to look all crazy.